brought me back to this, man, man, man. Good morning. How y'all doing, man? What's up, man? It's your boy, T.S., man. I know I'm a little dark, y'all. I apologize. I'm holding up. Y'all, you like, the light of your boy. You dig? Mm. Gotta stop this shit. Oh, all right. All right, y'all. Yesterday was amazing. Amazing. Some teams got to get back. Some teams went 0 and 2. But this is for the Saints and the Rams. This is, this is the Saints Rams video. Uh, really good game. Uh, another another ref blown call. I live in Louisiana, y'all. I'm not. I'm not a Saints fan. I live in Louisiana, but fair is fair. You know what I'm saying? It's like yeah. Yeah, they did blow. They did blow the call with Cam. You know, Cam dropped. I thought it was a fumble, honestly, because his arm was hit. The ball was out, and then he, then he pushed it forward with like his knuckle or something. So I thought the ball was out. But um, either way, it go. They won by eighteen points. So Saints had what nine? It was twenty-seven. You had seven on to nine. He's sixteen. Still got twenty-seven. Still lost the game. <laughs> he still lost though like in a championship game bro refs had the blown call Saints got the ball first in overtime you lost dude like I understand the blown call my G but you still lost like after the fact you can't hang. I'm saying if you hang in a whole game on. Uh, well, you can. Well, it depends on certain plays, but you can't hang that whole game on that one play when there was opportunities for y'all to win that game after that play. You know what I'm saying? But but with this penalty right here that they missed or this play, well, you think about it, they still got the ball back. So even though in the game the touchdown, he still didn't score. Drew Brees went out with an injury, bro. That was big. You know, but if you go look at the stats, he threw five passes before he got hurt. You know what I'm saying? He was three for five. He started off pretty well. But the two incompletions he had, one of them was an interception. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing I always wondered about Jerry Cook. I always knew, like, because if you remember when he was back with the Rams, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, remember Tyron Matthew with the big punch and fumble at the goal line? Uh, he 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 was always either a big play tight end, or he missed plays, or he dropped passes, or he fumbled. He was always that type of player, and the Saints brought him into this offense. Like, go back and look at that. You know what I'm saying? Michael Thomas had 13 targets. He caught 10 of them for like 93 yards. But it was like a lot of passes they were dropping from from Teddy was. I mean, they, they was missing from Teddy was dropped. The Saints were dropping passes when Teddy was in the game, bro. I know the rhythm off, the timing off. They probably weren't expecting their throws in certain areas because, you know, they, they've been practicing with Drew. You know what I'm saying? But, like, I'm not counting the Saints out with, with Teddy Bridgewater as they starting quarterback. I'm not counting them out. Not at all. Uh, yesterday was an adjustment. Uh, it's going to be an even bigger adjustment with Breeze. Being out, because we got to find out today what's going on. And I'm going to do a video on that later once we find out what, what exactly what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, we really, like, I, like I said, my Chargers took an L yesterday to the Lions. And it didn't feel good because it was like, you know, Lions rallied, rallied late. But uh, I feel like, the, you know what I'm saying, let's talk about the other side of the ball. Let's give credit to the Rams, bro. The Rams play good ball, bro. The Rams, like. They, they wouldn't too – they didn't run the ball too much. They didn't pass the ball too much. They ran it the just amount of time. They passed it just amount of time. They executed it, and they got stronger as the game, you know, went on. That's the thing that – I think that's what made the Rams so special yesterday. 
they got stronger as the game went on. To, no matter who the it really didn't matter who the quarterback was because they was coming after Breeze the same way they was coming after Teddy. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like the Saints O line held up pretty well against Aaron Donald for the most part. It's just you know towards the end, like I said, the Rams start to get stronger and stronger throughout the game. So you you know, so you know. Honestly, I feel like, yeah, that's what the last school, that's what ended up. But, like I said, you can't really say that kind of was the rematch. Like, I can say, like, the big rematch because, like, it got to happen inside of the dome for the Saints to feel like they, you know, this is the real rematch. You know what I mean? Because the game played was played in the dome. You know what I'm saying? And they had a blown call in L.A. too. But I feel like this ain't going to do nothing but start, uh, start a rivalry between the Saints and the Rams. So, it's going to be pretty cool. So if, if they don't meet in the playoffs next year, you know, definitely in the regular season, the NFL's going to schedule it as a regular season game. So and it's going to be in New Orleans, so it's going to be even more better. So more money for all all three, all three, four parties, really. All three parties, the NFL, the Rams, and the Saints. So wait, this is your boy, T.L. Man, y'all get in the comment section. Y'all let me know, man. What y'all think about the blown call? What y'all think about Drew Brees' hand? Uh, what y'all think about the Rams? They played pretty good ball. Uh, for the most part, a lot of holding penalties, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but, you know, it's still week two, you know what I'm saying? Your biggest improvement comes from week one to week two, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like, uh, I don't know, I want Drew Brees to play because I want him back on the field because, and I want the Saints at full power because if you beat them without him, it's just another excuse, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, you rather them at full strength playing their best ball, you know what I'm saying? So, Man, like I say, man, we hope Drew Brees gets better. You know, hope everything works out for him and his family, especially with his hand, because you know he's gonna, you know he's rich as hell. He's gonna be all right, but you know, hope everything gets right with his hand, because I want to see him at full strength. Uh, uh, Cam Jordan, ugh, monster. Cam Jordan's a monster, but like I said, bro, one play can't knock your whole game, because like I said, in the championship game, you went to overtime and you lost. The after the you know the blown call, and also in this game right here, like they gave they, I'm saying they messed up on the play on the touchdown, gave you the ball, didn't go down and score, got and these they, they won by eighteen, you know what I'm saying? So you add another six to your nine to your nine is, you know you still not winning the game. Maybe it's a momentum builder. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know, but. I don't know, man. But it's your boy T. Hills, man. Y'all get in my comment section. Let me know what y'all think about the Saints and Rams game. I thought it was pretty good, bro. You know what I mean? Now it's time to get back to it. Football. Yesterday. Oh, the Browns play tonight. I got to see this prime day.